meeting in Moscow, which finished during the weekend, didn't bring up the uh, dramatic uh, steps taken by uh, Japan in connection with the communique. That had as an immediate effect that the Japanese yen again is under strong pressure. Uh, US dollar Japanese yen is trading uh, very close to 94 in the morning, which is close to what we saw for a week ago with uh, 94.65. Also the British pound continues to be under strong pressure. It went beyond 155 this morning and is starting to trade very close to, to 154. Uh, the uh, uh, dollar is also a little bit stronger in relation to most currencies. When the uh, stock markets open in uh, Asia this morning, the uh, uh, Japanese market jumped 2.4% or 2.4% and saw its ha highest levels in a very long period of time. Uh, the strong uh, Japanese Nikkei is a result of the fact that it's now expected that the Japanese yen would continue to lose then uh, terrain against both the uh, dollar and other currencies. Uh, this had banks and export industries to boom. Otherwise, in uh, Asia today, the uh, MSCI for East uh, for the Asian Pacific was more or less flat. Australia was up. Uh, in uh, Europe, we would probably see a consolidation in the market today without too big changes. The uh, Euro, US dollar, was trading at 133.40 uh, this morning, which is stable in relation to the level we saw last week. Also, oil prices are a little bit weaker. Brent crude trading just below 118 a barrel. The gold prices, which saw a six-month low on Friday, has been picking up approximately 1% on bargain hunting and also due to the fact that the Chinese market, which has been closed for one week, uh, is now starting, Chinese traders are now starting to buy physical gold. I wish all of you a new good trading week from Mysos Investment and Cyprus.